And they have a pretty scary lane, like Shadow Shaman and Centaur. Both of those heroes hit like a trucks right now. Centaur with the new change to return. Feels like they're getting really aggressive down here already. And Sania getting uh, poked by LeBron's going to go for that roll forward immediately. Get that stun. They'll get that frost blast too as well. Trying to purge it off. They're going to jump forward. And it looks like Zania is probably going to be the first blood here, Kips. In fact, there it is. LeBron Dota. First blood. <laughs> oh, yes. That is, uh, that is a thing. But now it looks like Mickey might need to be a little bit careful. The body block's coming out here from Mitch. He's going to try to slow down again. Another frost blast. Oh, that is just not run away. This is not looking good at all. For I think this is going to be the end of uh, Mickey. Yeah, there it is. All right. This uh, lane is going shame. incredibly well right now for EPG. Who is winning the mid lane handily right now? Uh oh, it looks like the Air Spirit in for some trouble. Double Edge comes out, the crowd gets the purge off, but Insania gets that kill. There's just, like you said, it's really hard. You gotta hold down Branya here. And he's gonna go use that solve. Tiger comes well, through the woods. Oh, they're going right for the dive. They'll follow up with a nice blast. Oh, Egg's gonna get used though. They need to focus it up. Tiger actually just getting burnt down. Will they find it? They find the kill over onto the Tiger. Will get taken down. And the root coming out here from Insania. They got the fear though over here onto Quipa. And they don't have that dispel right now. They managed to find the kill over onto Lich though, it, regardless. We, we gotta be able to get some. Spell Amp on our own here as well. Hex in top lane, followed up with the Shackles, a Stomp, and an Aether Shock. Will secure themselves a rune and a kill. Where the Terra Blade is going to be. And now he can actually move into the Radiant Jungle as well and grab the camps over there. It's actually big. They don't realize it. Mitch has just picked up that Blink Dagger too here. Being very, very patient. It's just sitting nearby. There's a jump forward. Does manage to find that Pugna. Immediately the Hex comes out, followed up with that Egg. Oh, it's doing a lot of damage here. Mitch turns back around. They're just going to have to TP out the Pugna. They will lose the Shadow Shaman though. Excellent heads up TP by Quake for that. Well, isn't that one of the fastest ways, too, where you can just completely throw a game? Is you just, you get too caught up in the bloodlust, you decide you want to go for a fight. Oh, the jump forward, look at that beautiful jump <laughs> just coming out from the Sand King. Quake now also going to get Very taken good. down. Just the wrong part of town, my friends. Almost, it's getting there. A Lich might be in a bad part of town here. Yeah, the Hex gets used immediately. Roll forward coming out from LeBron, though. Gonna try to put some more damage over onto Shadow Shaman. I think this is a very dead Tiger. Yeah, the fear comes out, and there's gonna be a couple more clicks off. Magnetize will finish it up. And then as soon as, or even, you can start moving towards Pot oh. before already. No, oh, that's a really nice Mr. Glare coming out from DNC. They actually throw the Chain Frost out. It's gonna get a couple bounces <laughs> off of Roche. Oh my goodness, this is, uh, looks like Zayna gonna be all right though. Was able to go throw out that uh, magic immunity on himself. But they're still going in for a little bit more. There's no more Shrine up and running. Boxy still looking for that opening. Can he close the gap? There's a Silence being thrown out here by LeBron. It's gonna be the Frost Shield as well. Stomp comes up though. They've got the stun down. We'll be able to get that double edge on as well. Followed Good. with the Shackle. Oh, but a nice Burrow Strike coming out from Mitch. He tries really hard to keep him. He's not gonna be able to do it. In fact, that route comes out over onto the two of them. They're going to be keeping the mid wave Ooh. out now if they can. That was a very optimistic epicenter, but they turn right back around to Crepify Shackles. Double Edge <laughs> the Boxy's just playing with his food over here. It's still going to be Koifa who gets it with that life drain. They're going to be spreading their resources again. You can see two people on top, oh. two on bottom. Do you see how fast Lich is just like, oh no, oh no, throws on the Frost Shield. Immediately tries to pull back the Centaur. There's a lot of people here. There's about four different heroes trying to get this murder down. And there's a Sunray coming in. He's going to have to go use that. Uh, oh no, that last. Nothing coming out from Mickey. Life Giant coming out from Koifa. Going <laughs> to immediately oh. bash though. Bad luck. It does have a regen rune. There's no double damage rune right here, but it wasn't a respawn, right? They actually go and they use the wards too. I'm not sure if I would agree with that, but they haven't been seeing anything on the map. And this is something that, this is why they use the wards. It's because they haven't seen the Terra Blade in forever. He was on bot lane, but they didn't know he was on bot lane. On the jump forward here, Mitch going to be able to go immediately. Stun up the Shadow Shaman. He's going to the Hex going in. They tried to kick Mickey around. There's going to be the BKB coming out, though. Mickey's still getting that pick up here. And they'll get the Fortune Zed over here onto the Shadow Shaman. LeBron rolling forward. Egg's actually going to get used. Tiger trying to run himself home. I'm not sure it's going to be enough to stay alive here. Swift Ending already just walking himself away from this pit. And the TA is still just, she's so strong. Still running, still going, trying to get some vision. Doesn't have that BKB up anymore, but we'll try to chase after Baranya now. And there's going to be one of the Fire Spirits. They need something to cancel out that TP. Boxy's just a little too late. So now oh, they can no. cut off the bot, like top wave. All right, there's no thunder to save them this time. There's gonna be double edge followed with the. Uh, oh man, this Oracle doing work with that nuke. Boxy coming forward. They'll have the Yules out here, waiting for that stomp. Find it. He's gonna try to TP himself out, and I don't think they have anything else to cancel out that TP just yet. Boxy again, just a little bit too late. I didn't see that Some one. Slash strike. <laughs> I missed that. These daggers just coming through. They actually even they don't even have an Aegis anymore. Like that's how no, strongly they feel. There's a couple bounces coming out here. BKB's gonna come out. The Fierce Ball pulling them in, but they'll still be able to take down Mitch. Mitch gonna have to buy back. Now LeBron Dota gets taken down by Mickey, and they'll be able to take those uh mid-range barracks. There is nothing here. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's a dead Branya. We take a fight that side of the base. Okay, DNZ. Foxy finds him out immediately, throws the frost shield down. It's they were uh, baiting him and they know. I don't think they're gonna get much out of this no. though. Like Foxy just walks away and he still does have the uh Still have the ultimate to get. But they are claiming the high ground now. Oh man, look at Mickey. Mickey just slashes DNZ apart. He is now in the middle of three different heroes, though. They'll be able to get the fortune sense off. BKB is back up. Nice egg coming out here, but they need to take it down. He's just a little bit more dim. They're not going to find Insania trying to run himself out. These fights are totally split. They'll turn back around. They've got the hex over here onto LeBron. They'll actually take him down with the double edge. And now they've got their eyes over here onto Barania. Barania cannot. Have... Okay, never mind. Barania is dead. They do manage to find Insania. And now Swift ending. He's going to have to TP out. Do they have any? Oh, they've got the Yules. They'll turn back into this fight again. The hex X comes out, and this is going to be a very dead Terrorblade. They and still found themselves a little bit more over here. Hey, Mitch, what you doing there, buddy? You trying to go home? We can send you home there a lot faster. I'm just going to do it. This looks to be a pretty swift ending. <laughs> That's going to be the end of game number one. They call the GG Alliance. Okay, boys, I'm going to join the Alliance train. It's, you can't. It's, whoa. Uh, I, said back said you yeah, couldn't. Yeah, that's right. I said I wouldn't, and then I lied. I have a skewer. I am going to mess Ooh, with it. Oh, it goes down to here. bottom lane. It's actually the first blood gets drawn by Boxy, killing DNZ. And again, we talked about not having quite enough regen. They do manage to find the kill on Boxy as well. In the case where Quoikva doesn't have the greatest lane, Oh, Insania coming yeah, off from the side. Yeah, there's going to be Telekinetic Glyph throwing right back there. Nice Light Striker away. Do I have enough damage with that Burning Spear? Yeah, they find the kill over onto Barania. Some and converging over here, too. Looking for those runes. They know Bulldog's watching. <laughs> <laughs> Frosty gets used. There's going to be Stroke of Fate as well. Boxy actually in for some trouble now. He's going to get sandwiched between several of these guys. The tossback comes out, and it looks like maybe he can get himself away. I don't know. That's a lot of damage here. LeBron, he's still hungry for it. Shockwave comes out. Not quite enough damage here. DNZ going to get taken down by the Rubik, I think. Yeah, he's going to get taken down. Actually, by Boxy. Experienced of the two cores, right? Of Alliance. This is looking not great for Barania here. He's feeling very, very optimistic. Quaifa having to run himself out. Light Striker comes through. He's actually going to be able to find that kill. So they're not about to start moving. I think they thought that they were going to get that Wonderful Sinister Gaze off just a little bit earlier here. Boxy toss back here over onto the Jug. Still have that Sinister Gaze. There's going to be the jump forward here coming up from Blonde. Inkswell will land, though. Nice stroke of fate coming through. That's a lot of cleave damage. Can they take down Boxy fast enough? It's looking pretty good. Phantom's Embrace going to get used over on the Jug, and they're going to be able to take him out. Oh my goodness, now it looks like LeBron trying to run himself away here. Can he get out fast enough? It's not looking too good. There's a lot of little kits coming out. It's actually going to be Taiga. Yeah, he's going to look for this Darkseer here. Mitch going to have to try to go. Use that Ion Shell over here on the Creeps, trying to uh, keep going. Still not going to be able to run away fast enough. Not with the haste rune over here on Quaifun. He's got a lot of damage here. Mickey coming through, actually jumping through as well. We'll be able to get the kill over onto Mitch. That revenge kill, right? Again, look, it's just, a, just such a strong combo. Taiga going to get taken down. Sinister Gaze plus the spin. Boxy now coming forward here. Doesn't have too, too much to offer at this time. We'll be able to go throw out that stun. Toss back, though, over here onto the Jug, into the tower, into Insania, actually, with that lift. Throwing him right back again. Going to be able to skewer them back. Nice save coming out for LeBron. They still have that healing ward up and running. Swift ending. Going to be able to make it out. Uh, and, of course, Darkseer, you know, he's had the ability to just hang out in the jungle. Easy peasy, no problem. 74 CS about to be expected here. Bottom lane, though, looks like the Boxy might be in for some trouble again. He's got the Omni Slash over on him, and he's going to have to try to run out. Spin comes through. Fear spell holding him into place. That should be a kill for Swift ending. No problem. Brani is getting taken down by Koifa as well, and now it looks like DNZ. Oh, DNC, he's trying to juke. Cannot find any trees, though, available. Will get taken down. Away from that fight? What, was there even anyone away? I think it might be in a little bit of trouble here if they can hold him still. They get... Not much for bounces over here. Try to get the light striker right. Not going to be able to land it. That spell coming out uh -oh. again. He's getting a little bit body blocked. He's got the spell shield. Should be able to. Again, they just don't have the lockdown. They no, don't have enough lockdown. Just died to his own. <laughs> oh, did he? Yeah, he died to his own ultimate, bouncing off of the one ancient creep that was in the camp right there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that, that is an are you kidding good. me, LeBron? <laughs> yes. Oh no! What a disaster! It's gonna be the toss over here in the mid lane. They've got their eyes on Lena and Barania. It's gonna get taken down. There's gonna be the RP though. They've dropped the wall as well. LeBron trying to force us out. There's gonna be Spellbind coming out. They're gonna try to slow him down. Swift ending finds himself a kill. Still chasing after Taiga here. Taiga might be in for some trouble. Phantom Spear getting thrown right back onto him. He's gonna try to break some ankles over here. Nice toss back though coming out from Tiny. They still have their eyes over here. Koifa gonna try to push them all back, but that's a lot of damage coming out from that Omni Slash. Swift ending again. They find the kill over onto LeBron as the anti mage joins in the fight now. Wants to try to do something, but won't be able to go and cancel out that TB over onto Swiss ending. These two towers from the side, and they carry the least about the top lane. Foxy just runs into everyone over here. He's got his eyes over on LeBron. He's 
Just gonna keep chasing them. They've got the TP coming out now from the anti mage. We'll be able to get the avalanche off. Run toss back out towards the tower and just starts playing around with the anti mage, trying to give him a seizure, I guess. But eventually, McKay gets that kill. It's nice to see them having fun, though, right? Mm -hmm. Heels comes out, Light Striker Ray will land over here. It's gonna be the spin though, and Sania can't spin away from all that damage. Neither can Taiga. It's a double kill coming out here for Swift Ending. They can take Roche. And if you got Roche, you bought yourself some time. Right. It looks like they're gonna be able to take down Taiga at the very least. There's gonna be the steal though coming out from Rubik. He's got the Omni Slash. Well, that is very um, non-impressive right about now. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mickey in the top lane goes for it. They get the kill on Dark Curry, but it looks like they got a Lizbor Ninja. They try to keep him alive for as long as possible, but eventually Mickey finds himself that kill. They want to go in on this. Mm -hmm. Well, EPG are sticking to the rule. They saw the anti mage on board. They yeah, decide to go for it. Like, one of them is not there. They don't have detection either. Like, oh, look at the jump for a box. He's going to throw him right back in. There's going to be a vacuum coming out from Insania here. He got the Lina stuck inside the pit. Yeah. Going to go for it. Nice Soulbind coming out now from Taiga. They need to get enough damage down. They're going to be able to go. Double okay, going right out. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful. They take him down. They dropped a wall, but it doesn't mean a whole heck of a lot of anything right now. Insania now it looks like they'll finally be able to take down Taiga. LeBron's trying to fight his way through. He cannot do it. And that's going to be a dead Darks here as well. There's just too many stacks of burning. That's a team wipe, Kips. That right now doesn't pay off, but that would have been very good in case you play against a team that is still capable. Oh, oh, the three-man avalanche coming through. Yules comes out. They've got the frost shield over here onto Brownie, and they're going to jump forward immediately. Am just jumps. He gets that lich kill right Double off the bat. There's lift. a missile blind. They're going to just bounce this around. Ooh, this is not looking good. Lena's going to get taken down. Mitch gets taken down. They find a kill over onto the back end, though. Do manage to get down Taiga, but they're pretty happy about it. He's already got his ultimate out. LeBron trying to run himself away will get taken down, and there's a little bit more damage right there. Swift ending. He's out of here, and I don't know, Kips. I do know. I do. This, is, this is over. <laughs> I'm trying to be positive, but... Uh, yeah, they take everything off of their checklist. Yep. And then in the end, they get to do the double splat with the Grimstroke ulti. And that is... That's the cherry on the cake.